So last week you met Muriel Siebert. Back in 1967, she was the first woman to own a seat on the New York Stock Exchange. Well, this week, you gotta meet Victoria Woodhall. She was actually the first female broker. She and her sister opened the first female stock brokerage firm right here on Wall Street. Well, you can imagine the sensationalist news and cartoons that came out after they opened the firm, but they didn't care. They took on all these female clients, made all this money. Woodhall went on to start the first woman-run newspaper. And as a matter of fact, took all the money they made, she used it to back her run. She was the first female to run for president of the United States. And she continued to push forward with the feminist movement and was the first woman to sit before Congress to fight for women's rights. So Woodhall later went on to say, quote, we went onto Wall Street, not particularly because I wanted to be a broker, but because I wanted to plant the flag of the women's rebellion in the center of the continent. So as I stand here in the center of the business universe, I guess I have Woodhull to thank for it. So be sure to stay tuned for thestreet.com for more inspirational stories from the women of Wall Street.